Tragic death of Brooke Shields co-star David Strickland echoes after 25 years. Zach Bagans captures eerie audio of David Strickland, sheds new light on tragic suicide Brooke Shields co-star David Strickland, a prominent figure in American film and television during the 1990s, was celebrated for his wholesome persona, clean-cut appearance, and comedic talents. Despite his rising stardom, behind the scenes, Strickland grappled with profound mental health challenges and substance abuse issues. Tragically, these struggles culminated in his untimely death by suicide at the age of 29, alone in a Las Vegas motel on March 22, 1999. Just days before his death, his final film Forces of Nature had debuted at the top of the box office charts. He had embarked on a romantic relationship with Tiffany Thiessen, renowned for her role in Saved by the Bell. In October 1998, he was arrested for alleged possession of cocaine, leading to a plea of no contest on December 21st of the same year. Placed on 36 months probation and mandated to undergo rehabilitation following an arrest related to cocaine possession, took an unexpected turn days before his scheduled appearance in Los Angeles Municipal Court for a progress report on his drug treatment. Departing from Los Angeles to Las Vegas alongside comedian Andy Dick, Strickland engaged in days of intense partying in local strip clubs, deviating from his court-mandated path. Strickland, who battled bipolar disorder, reportedly ceased taking lithium and antidepressant medication prior to his demise. The recovering alcoholic consumed six bottles of beer before ending his own life by hanging. His body was discovered by the investigator in his motel room, where he had used a bed sheet as a means of suicide. The Clark County Coroner's examination revealed previous suicide attempts, evident from scars on Strickland's wrists. Although no suicide note was found, nor were any long-distance calls made from his room, police concluded the incident as suicide, stating, We found nothing to indicate anything but a suicide. 